everybody I had a great time in Japan. I spent nine days uh, with a seven day Japan rail pass where I covered the entire island from Nagasaki to Ayamore. And in this video, I'm gonna take the Hayabusa high speed bullet train from Shinjuku Station in Tokyo to Ayamore in Northern Japan. train ride from Shinjuku train station in Tokyo it took about four hours. I loved how clean the train was, especially the bathroom. It was a great train ride and I saw all kinds of beautiful sights, including Mount Fuji. If you haven't seen my video on Mount Fuji, and Lake Kawaguchiko, I hope you check that out. And like all my videos, I hope you find them informative and entertaining. And if so, please hit that like button and consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. It'll really help me out. Anyway, sit back and join the train ride as we go from beautiful weather in Tokyo to very cold temperatures up there in Ayamori. Uh, had been a long time since I seen some snow. I loved it. It's also been a long time since I've been that cold. Didn't like that too much. Anyway, I had a quick stop there and just wanted to cover the rest of the island and I'm glad I did. Amori is known as the most snowiest city in, in the world. According to Google, it gets an average of 311 inches of snow every year. When I originally set out for the day, I planned on going up to Hakodate. But as you saw on the previous screen before this, it was 22 degrees there. So I figured I might as well just stop in Ayamori, where it was a balmy 25 degrees. Well, I was gonna go all the way to Hakodate. Then I saw the snow and the temperature. Is this snowing here in Ayamore? And I want to get a window seat going back because I didn't have one going up. And if I go to Hokodate, it'll be too dark on the way home. So let's go see some snow. I read that this is like the snowiest place on the, in Japan. I also think I read it was the Big Apple in Japan. Let's look at this. Hey, I'm in Ayamori, Japan, and it's snowing. I'm loving it. Beautiful. It's like a Christmas tree. Merry Christmas. Let's go into the city of Ayamori from the uh, train station. So, who do you line? Track number one for Ayamori. I guess it'll be track two on the way back. Look at the snow on these tracks. Hey, I'm at the train station in Ayamori, Japan. Shin Ayamori, heading to the town of Ayamori. Look at the snow. It's cold too, like 22. Haven't seen that in a while. Man, was it cold. But I love seeing all the snow. I haven't seen it in a while. And the trains were very nicely heated. And I even got to look out the conductors or the train driver's window for that point of view. It was fantastic. Amori. Oh 
Amori train station. A Amori train station. About a 10 minute ride, not even, from Shinomori. The A Factory was a very cool store slash cafe slash brewery, lots of apple cider, and a bakery. They had awesome stuff in there. Anyone know what these Easter egg looking things or balloons are? They were all over the place. They were really cool. I just can't figure out what they're called. If anybody knows, feel free to send me a comment. This kind of reminded me of, I used to walk uphill through six feet of snow both ways just to get to school. Now we do crazy stuff just to get a selfie. That's the Hotel Alaska in Naomi, Japan. Appropriate. Look at the snow. And across the street, the Hotel Sunroof. Hey, I'm already. Huh. I keep here to check the temperature how cold it is. Hey, I'm already Japan here today. It's been snowing probably all day. It was so icy, I almost took a digger here. Whoops. Looks like the Polar Express. <laughs> Okay, all aboard the Polar Express. Hey, I'm Mori Japan. It is cold here and it's been like a blizzard all day. Trip up to Ayamori was just a quick excursion that I had a great time at. Now let's enjoy the train ride going back where I recorded a speed of 197 miles per hour, but my app said actually the fastest was 199. Wow. Well, I arrived back to Tokyo, then I just had to get up in the morning and see a little bit more of Tokyo, like the busy pedestrian walkway, and then head back to the airport, back to the States. I had a great nine days in Japan and I love the seven day Japan Rail Pass, even though it's quite a bit more expensive than it used to be. For covering the entire Honshu Island like I did, I definitely saved a lot of money. It was great. Thanks for watching another episode of Rick's Trips. We'll see you next time.